What is going on everybody and welcome to part 17c of Gary's Mod Game Mode Scripting. In today's part we will be actually utilizing this use function here and actually making this ammo dispenser give us ammo when a user clicks on it. Or when a user uses it. So first thing we want to do in our initialize function, we want to do something called set use type. So self colon set the use type like so and we want to do simple underscore use. And again, this will make it so it only calls this use function one time per click. So they click the use button, gives them ammo, unclick it, click it again, it'll give them ammo, and so forth. And I will show you the default for this as well in just a second. But for now, let's go into our use function and actually have this give some ammo. First thing we need to do is get the ammo type of the current weapon the player is holding using a local ammo type. I want to set this equal to the activator, which is the person activating or using the entity. So activator colon get active weapon. Oops, there we go. This will get the current weapon they are holding. Then we want to do colon get primary ammo type. And that will do exactly what the name says. It'll get the primary ammo type for their current weapon they're holding. Let's just write a comment there. It'll get get primary weapons ammo type. Next step, we use a built-in uh, built-in function that is a part of the entity. So activator, because that's the entity we want to use. Colon give ammo. This will take in three arguments. The first one being the amount of ammo we want to give. And I'm just going to put that as five, comma. The second argument, the type of ammo, and we created a handy variable up here that has that ammo type in it. So we just do ammo type, comma, and then the third argument is whether or not you want to hide the notification pop-up. And again, I'll show you both ways here. Just for now, I'm going to do true, because I don't want that to show up. So save that, go into the game, and spawn a brand new ammo dispenser entity. When you click on it, if you get to a weapon that has ammo, if you pay attention to the ammo in the HUD section, every time I click it, my ammo is going up by five. And as you can see, if I hold it down, nothing happens. It only does it when I unclick it and click it again. Now, if we didn't have the self set use type here, so let's comment that out, save it, and go back and spawn another new entity. And now if you look at the HUD, when I hold it, it keeps going up constantly. And I don't have to unclick it and click it again. So again, that's not what I want. If you want it, you can go ahead and leave this part out. But for this, for this series, I'm going to use the simple use type. And also, got to save that. As you can see, whenever we do this, there's no notification on the right-hand side. If I want there to be a notification, I change this true to a false, because I do not want to hide the pop-up. Go back into game, spawn a new one. And if you pay attention to the right-hand side of the screen, Every time I click it, that notification will pop up telling me the type of ammo that I got and then the amount. So that is going to conclude part 17C of Gary's Mod Game Mode Scripting. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.